Hi there, and I just wanted to talk about a feature that I've discovered purely by accident on YouTube recently. And it's a feature that allows you, allows you to take anything from a five to one minute long clip from a specific video and then have that clip emailed to someone on a social network, um, you know, on a website, for instance. Um, it's on this, it's rolling out at the moment and there are some very specific caveats around it. So you might not have it on your uh, your YouTube channel yet. And it is only featured, it appears to be on videos that are more than two hours long. Also, it can't be on videos that are intended for children. That's one of the things. So when you upload a video, you've got an opportunity of saying whether it's for children or not. So you can't take clips from videos that fall into that kind of category. However, it's, it's a cool feature, which I hope they develop. Um, but at the moment, it is rolling out, so you might not see it. Um, and it, it seems to appear only on very long videos of over two hours. I, the research I did suggested only an hour, um, but I've tried a couple of hour and a half, hour and 40 minute videos, and it hasn't appeared. As soon as the video goes over two hours, it seems to be there. So I'm just gonna share my screen, my YouTube channel, so you can see what is going on. So if I just hit share screen, and we will go over here. Perfect, so I apologize for the very geeky nature of this particular video. Um, you know, I can't help myself, I, I, I'm a gamer, but also gaming videos are often quite long. Um, so I've got a two hour video here. And what you'll notice down at the, uh, the bottom underneath the video is you've got this clip icon. Uh, it's very simple, if you select clip, what I'll do, you can see, oh, we need to skip the ad, let's get rid of that. So you can't clip while ads are playing. Um, and I'm just gonna pause the video over here. Uh, I am however long into the video now, 56 seconds, uh, 56 minutes and 40 seconds. You can see over here, um, there is 56 and 28, which is when the clip starts. And over, over here, we've got a timeline. This is, it defaults to a 15 second clip. I can move this around um, to different parts of the video so I can fine tune my clip. And then very simply, if I want it to be longer, I grab and move that way. So it's now a maximum of 60 seconds, or I can grab and I've got a minimum of five seconds. So that clip maximum of 60 seconds currently, minimum of five seconds. So there's my 60 second clip. I need to give it a title and I'm going to call it test clip in here and then very simply hit oh we've got public as well to say that it will be shared publicly and then i hit the share clip button and essentially what i get once it processed is this url here that i can simply copy and then i can paste that into a social network such as facebook um, into a website into an email whatever i want to do it's just taking a short 60 second clip of that particular video that then I can share to people. So I just hit the copy button and away it goes. So that's how you do it. It's incredibly simple as often things are on YouTube. Uh, YouTube does like to make things nice and simple, nice and elegant when they are you know, creating these things. So that is just how to get the clip. Now, once you've done it, it is actually saved on your account. So I'll show you where to find that in a moment. Um, but that clip is, is you know, if there's a, a particular part of a longer video that you want to share with someone, uh, a great way of just, you know, popping that out there. Or one of your own videos that you want to highlight or perhaps even, you know, promote. You can take that clip, that 60 second clip to promote a section of a video um, that will hopefully entice people to come in and watch the longer version. I sincerely hope that they um, bring that down to, you know, clips of, of much shorter, you know, even a 10 minute um, video, you know, you can take a minute clip from that, which would be, you know, fantastic. Uh, and also potentially give us an opportunity to go beyond 60 seconds. But this is rolling out right now. So I just wanted to let you know it was here. Now, once you've created the clip, you can actually, all those clips are stored and you can um, go back and have a look at the clips you've done previously. So if I just share my screen again, so we go share screen and over here and hit the share button. Um, if I go over here, you can see that I've got your clips over in this uh, this menu on the left hand side. If I go into my clips, there we go. The other two, this is one I was practicing on a little while ago. So you can see, um, and that can be shared. So you can share it to whichever one's from there uh, and also can be deleted, which I'm going to do. Delete the clip. Once you've no further use for it, you can delete it. Um, so I just wanted to share that with you. It's, it's an interesting feature. At the moment, I say it seems to be rolling out at the moment and um, it's a bit 
flaky in the way it's presented so far. Obviously, it is in that period of rollout where the information I've seen says it was for clips that are an hour um, or longer, and it seems only to kick in when I've got a clip that's over two hours long, um, and it is five to seconds to a minute on those videos. But it's a feature that I hope catches on. It's a feature that if it is enabled on your uh, on your account and you've got videos of that length, is worth engaging with. So I thought I'd share that with you. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you found it useful. If you have, just give it a thumbs up or a, a reaction. Um, but have a fantastic day. Stay well, keep safe, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye for now.